We, the senior Muslim officials of uh, Muslim Balala community, are present here. I will give you a brief introduction before I continue with my statement. On my immediate right is uh, the community chairman, Honorable Shiraz Adam Tay. Uh, next to him is our Honorable Trustee, Community Trustee, Mr. Hassan Jetwa. To my left is Mr. Karim Jetwa, who was uh, one of the candidates on the material day, on which I need to give a clarification. Uh, to my immediate left, uh, to, the, to his left, it's our Vice Chairman, Mr. Uh, Ahmad. Jadeja. We have come here together this afternoon to give a clarification next of this month, which was the Sunday that passed last Sunday. Our community, Muslim Barala Jamaat, had called a general meeting for its membership. And the membership were very well informed in advance and as per the constitution that governs our daily business. Members gathered on that material day, I want to first give a clarification. Members gathered on that uh, material day on the 26th and the meeting was supposed to start by 10 o'clock. So our members, our legitimate members, and I repeat, our legitimate members, arrived and peacefully registered their names in time, and by 10 o'clock the meeting commenced. The meeting went on smoothly, and uh, we started the business of the day with the agenda that was set and the meeting went on up to around 11.30, 11.45, somewhere there. At that juncture, while the meeting was on and all the three candidates who were to wait for the candidature, I mean for the, for the chairman's seat, were all seated inside here. Uh, we heard some commotion because we, as the, the, the senior officials of our community, were inside there presenting our reports. We heard some commotion and we decided to see what was happening. To our surprise, we saw that there are some people who claim to be from our community but they, they are not from our community and neither have they ever been from our community. These people, these members of the public, were stopped on the gate because that function, that general meeting was only for the Muslim Badala community and not any outsiders. We have a constitution that guides our whatever, our daily business, we have a constitution here and it says everything. And Muslim Barala Jamaat is a registered society. It was registered under the colony and protectorate of Kenya under the society's rule in 1952. So it is a registered society and we had to stop any outsider from entering here because these outsiders have previously also disrupted our meetings. I'll go back and cite one incident of 2018 when we called a general meeting. These are the same outsiders who have disrupted our meeting unlawfully and we had quite a bit of uh, issues with them. 
all the same, our meeting after uh, we had to, you know, go on. And uh, the community was very upset with what had happened. Then, this time round, we, as I earlier said, we had three candidates who were vying for the chairman, who were vying for the chairman seat on the material day. So normally we have our reports, our financial reports, our, we have a, a fully fledged nursery, primary and secondary school. So we have to give the reports from there also. We have to give the reports of the development, whatever you are seeing around here, all the infrastructures and everything. And that is what was happening. But there is this one candidate who had waited for the chairman seat in 2014 and he lost heavily. After losing, it's our feeling that he has developed a grudge against those who, against whom he lost. So, 2018, he, the same people, and one of them being his family member interrupted that meeting, a very close family member. He has been using the, his family members to interrupt our meetings to harass the sitting committee unnecessarily. And he also did the same on the 26th. On 26th, he did not have any following. We were shocked to see the press release whereby he was outside the premises before the meeting he was claiming that his members were not let in that is true those members those followers who were supporting him were not from our community and i categorically state those whom we had stopped were not and have never been part of our community these were some of the hooligans who were out there so we had the, the security and uh, everything was going smoothly up to the time at around ten, halfway through the meeting these people get crashed they get crashed they all ran the security personnel and came in 